this is rumble on the monthly chart and you can see this huge buy wick to begin the month of January as prices testing resistance at five dollars and eighty cents and roughly six dollars and twenty cents if we go down to the weekly chart we can see that resistance a bit better again this pivot low and then this pivot low as well again all in that six dollar range and the good news for the bulls is that you would definitely take out all this trading that occurred in that four dollars and seventy five cents level which is going to serve as uh, some resistance um, nevertheless what is causing the pump in the stock let's look at this article and then we'll continue with the analysis we'll look at where price can go from current levels so two conservative companies have joined forces first you got rumble the video sharing platform and then you got barstool sports the site that began as a Boston sports and gambling publication in 03 has grown into one of the country's most popular culture and lifestyle brands, especially among male consumers, thanks to Dave Poitnoy. Now, while Rumble stock is surging today as the news of this deal trends, its growth is likely due much more to the momentum sparked by two political events. First, you, got, you had Donald Trump winning the Iowa caucus, and then you have Florida governors Ron DeSantis dropping out of the race. As a company closely linked to conservative pol politics, Rumble is usually impacted by any news that affects Trump. Now, Rumble stock is enjoying an excellent trading day as of this writing. It is up almost 30%, though it has lost some of that previous momentum. Now, it's moving in tandem with Trump's trade digital world asset um, acquisition corp, which is a SPAC. Uh, between Trump Media and Technology Group. Now, Rumble is coming off a difficult year with very little growth. Shares have fallen more than 41% over the past two quarters, leaving investors with plenty of room to be skeptical about its future prospects. You also have Rumble facing a regulatory probe from the U.S. SEC due to allocations of regulatory fraud. That's likely to hang over the company for some time, further compromise its growth prospects. So, whether you got in near the $3.50 level, should take some off the table. Whether you went high and rode all the way down, should take some off the table, even if it's a loss. Uh, based on the fundamentals, Rumble's gonna have a difficult time growing in the future. Let's go to the daily chart. We had two consecutive gap hires. Again, how far can this momentum ride higher? Look for target coming in at the $7 level. Not only that's where the 200 day moving average is sitting, but that is also where we had previous support, which should be resistance. How does that look on the weekly chart? Let's scroll up. Yeah, that would be a nice target to end this momentum before we see a pullback in the stock. Thanks for watching. Subscribe. Please like the video.